to another Minecraft video. Today in this video, I'm doing something a little bit different, and I'm here on, this is on console by the way, but um, today I am on my redstone world on my console, and today I'm going to teach you how to make your very own combination lock. Okay, so in this, my lock is one, two, three, four. You can have it anything you would like to. This is just mine for showing you guys. So one, two, three, and four. And then that door opens. You come in, you step on the pressure plate. Now, if you wanted it to close behind you, basically, you're going to need uh, something to activate this piston here so you just go ahead and boom boom and yeah so let's go ahead and hop in to showing you guys how to build it so the things that you're going to need for this you're going to need some redstone of course you will need redstone torches you'll need pistons and sticky pistons you'll need redstone repeaters you will need Let's see, what else will you need? Uh, and a couple blocks of your choice. Oh, you will need sand as well. And then you will need a couple blocks of choice. I like to use colored blocks to represent different things in my redstone. So, I'm going to go ahead and grab some blue, green, yellow, and white. But... Oh, and red. Yellow. Okay, so we need a white. We basically just need a red now. So, let's go ahead and get that. And, okay, there we go. So, we won't need this sticky piston until the end, so you can go ahead and just put that up in your inventory somewhere. Okay, so let's go ahead and start, shall we? And, <laughs> okay, of course we'll need buttons, too. Leave it to me for to forget about that. And your block of choice, which I'm just going to be using wood to show you guys. Um, I'm not prepared, am I? <laughs> okay, there we go. So, we'll start out. We'll need to make... And I did get this um, redstone from a YouTuber named FedEx Gaming. And he's pretty cool. Um... He's, uh, this is where I got this from anyways. But, okay, so here, this is the, uh, the key, or the, um, whatever you call it. This is the key thing, where you punch in the, uh, code. So this is the lock. Um, so what you're going to want to do after you build this, you come around back, you place four torches on each side. So then you'll take, I don't know, I'm just going to use green, but you're going to do this. I will be peeking a little bit at that because I'm not, I don't have this completely in my memory, but it's pretty close. Okay, so once you, uh, once you put the torches down, you're going to put two blocks on the left and right of the redstone torches, and then you're going to put, uh, redstone on top of either of those blocks. So, uh, then we're going to put repeaters all along there, and boom, that is that, and then once you do that, the, so this is how you um, do the keys. Like, see, hold on, let me just show you. So one, one will go off, and this is one. Then two, they're not in order, but this is two over there. Then three would be that, and then four, of course, would be this. So they're not in order, but, uh, yeah. So let's keep on going. So we're going to want to dig down two in front of all of these repeaters. And then just add more, another row of repeaters there. And we're going to keep on doing this. So just keep doing that. So now we have two of those. We need to add another row of repeaters. And make sure the repeaters are facing to where they're going out. The same way as you put your first repeaters. So you got two. Oh, that's not right. Okay. Um, so you need, let's, it looks like we need to do it one more time. So, yeah, here we go. So, once you do this, this is basically where you're going to choose your keys. So, of course, you can do any one of them, but my code, since my code is 1234, you come all the way to the back, 
and we need to see again which repeater is connected to which button so one this one is of course so in this row we come all the way to the back so that's the first key we put in so if it were say if it were three for you you'd go over here if you wanted like three two one or three two one four or something then you could have so three is i can't tell because okay so three is this one so instead of putting one right here if you wanted um three to be it you would put it right here now so let's continue um so my second number is two so we're just going to click on that so it's this one so you want to come to the second one here so that's one two so that means you gotta press it in order for it to work right so then you do one two three and so three would be here so you bring it here and of course four we already know where that'll be but it's right here uh okay so now what we're gonna want to do is just go ahead and dig two down here like so and uh put the uh the one of your colored blocks here 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 and then you're gonna put some redstone torches on top of each one and put a trail of redstone from the block on your code to the redstone torch now you can keep on doing this of course to that and then for each one uh it now it's connected to that torch now what you're going to want to do is build on top of it with blocks here only to where the repeaters only to where the repeaters are covered so see that repeater turned on because that block is there so you just want to keep on doing that over the repeaters like that and then once we do that we're we're going to need to set up some pistons on top of each of these now turned off redstone torches and put some sand on top of each one of those uh, whoops that's not what i meant to do and uh... now we're gonna put some blocks in between each of the sand blocks that the pistons are holding up so now let me just show you guys see this i use blue and oh no i use green over here still so this is what it what we're building right now so we're doing that right now so we gotta add kind of a fishtail to the end and let's get over here first okay so we add like this a fishtail is what I think of whenever I see it and we put a torch there now we're gonna put some redstone repeaters all in between these blocks and after we do that that is basically our code itself so one two three four now as you can see that made the blocks come up but um we're not done yet that's just uh part of it now to reset it we're at the moment we have to destroy that torch and then put it back down but we still got to add our reset button and uh basically a lot of other stuff we're not even halfway done guys okay so now what we're gonna do to add the reset button is or add the whole reset process so we're gonna wherever you put that block is where you can't put a torch so i know it might sound confusing but since that one here this one i'll just start up here look this is one so you put those there and not here because remember this is where the block is we put guys so you can get, always go check if you don't remember it so you can put see okay but so I remember the uh, second number is two and it was like this and then the third number was one away from the back so it's boom 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 and then delete that one because that's where the block is of course and um so this one of course we know is this now because we've done all the other ones so now once we do that we're going to take out another block of our choice i'm going to use blue so we're just going to go ahead and do this we just fill the entire row above the redstone torches like this and uh yeah this is like 
basically a copy of FedEx Gaming's work, but I just wanted to share this with you guys because I thought he did such a good job. So, uh, FedEx, if you're watching this, really thank you for this idea. Uh, so, once you do this, you're going to add some more. Hold on just a second, guys. Sorry, my dog's being crazy. Okay, so, you're going to add some more to right here. So, what you're going to do here is trail redstone from the beginning of this and take it all the way down. So, just on all four of these. So, once you do this, we're going to add some... Okay, so you do that, guys, just in case. Uh, so after that, we're going to add some pistons with sand on top of them. Uh, I think that's right. Yeah, 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 Okay, so this is the... I'll just show you guys the part that we're building now. So we do that, and then we're building this part now, which is linked to the reset button here. Now, um... Okay, so yeah, we're building this now. So let me just take a real quick look at this. Sorry, guys. So it comes out from here. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, we're going to take that same block we used for that, take it here, and did not mean to do that. You take it two blocks there. Then, oh, no, no, sorry, 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 guys. Two blocks from there, not there. Um, okay, so, what you're going to do, put a piece of redstone here, a repeater here, a repeater here, a repeater here, a repeater here, and some dust here right yeah i think that's right yes it is okay so after we've done that we want to l basically link that to a block here which there we go so we're gonna have that as you can see this is what we're doing now we're doing this underneath part here so uh, we gotta link that Uh, okay, so go ahead and put another block here, and I don't really, I, I just do that. Uh, okay, so basically what you want to do is you want to do a staircase down here because you want to link this redstone, and you can't do it really any other way. Okay, so you're going to take it down here, and you want to stop here, take your repeater out, take that and that, and then you want to set these to four ticks. And uh, this does work on PC too, guys. I've already tested it. Uh, I don't know about Pocket Edition. Sorry, guys. Um, <laughs> so once you do that, you're also going to want to have a piece of redstone there, I do believe. Yep. Okay. And then, as you can see on this already built one, we want to co basically connect this side. Oh, hey, Piggy. Get over there. Okay, so we want to connect that with the uh, fishtail torch. Um, okay, so, we, oh, crap, no, is the repeater, okay, yeah, yeah, so the repeater is coming out of the block with the torch, so you just want to do that, and then bring the redstone over there, so basically, guys, that is the reset thing, so, uh, we'll just test it out to make sure it works, so basically what this does is or no this is so you can't like say uh normally if you just had this people would just go over and be like oh yeah, yeah i could guess your password just by doing this but since they we have added this puppy they cannot so you just go ahead and press one again and then they all come back down okay so that's that now what we're gonna do is we are going to add stuff um so this is what we'll be building now right here so this is basically the button to reset everything so like i'll just show you guys on this one real quick the password's still one two three but i'm just gonna have that up oh nope that didn't okay so just, uh, one two three see those are up uh see if we wanted to get those down we could just do that, and do that, nope, that didn't work, okay, well, uh, you're still going to want to have that reset reset button there, because, 
sometimes redstone is just stubborn. Uh, so, let's see. Let's just go ahead and get this down. Sorry, guys. Um, okay, so let's move back along to our uh, redstone contraption that we're working on now. Okay, so we're going to grab some white and have this like that there then have it going at or yeah it's going out of that block and it's going in to where the button will be so the button guys will be here and let's see here and see that's up oh hold on technical difficulties see those blocks over there are up that should take it down I believe no I'm probably just wrong but there is a um, sorry guys my dog is being crazy okay so that there is a <laughs> used to that button sorry about that but now we are gonna be building another part to it guys where okay right, so up here I'll show you the part we're building now we're building this yellow part here which connects this to the input I believe yeah so it's where it's basically how the whole thing opens up so let's go back over here so and you guys sorry about that I don't know if I said anything or not but you will need either glowstone or uh, slabs which I'm gonna use glowstone because it lights up the place and it's just cool um Actually, no, I'm going to use slabs because I haven't actually tried glowstone yet. And I'm a little nervous. I don't want to be screwing it up in this video for you guys because I know you guys want to have the best possible thing you can have. And, uh, yeah. Okay, so this is what you're going to do. You want to build up here. Then bring it all the way back here. And then you want to build up one. Then you're going to put a redstone repeater facing going out of this block here and then you're just going to want to trail your redstone this way and why did that light up uh hold on just a second guys that should not have came up okay well uh, i'm sure it'll be fun let me just see what I did wrong here for a minute, guys. So, it comes out of there. Do I have anything over here? Um, what's powering that? So, it's that redstone there. See, so guys, I make mistakes, too, and we got to do it. This right for you, people. Um, what is wrong here? Huh, I don't know, but we'll keep building until we find out that something is wrong. Okay, so next, what we're, we're going to want to grab some red stain clay and uh, put it here, and we're just going to plop some redstone on that there, and then we're going to have a piston there along with some sand on top of it, and then another block there and we're almost done guys so see i'll show you the part we'll build we're building now it's right here so we're gonna ha want to have redstone repeater coming out of the sand block so like that now we're gonna want to just put a block there and now our sticky piston comes into play where we have it there and we want to have another redstone clay block there so basically let me just show you dog be quiet Nikki okay one two three four now hold on just a second guys I'm sorry my dog is being absolutely crazy right now okay so let's go ahead and press this button I'm just gonna press a couple times cuz I don't know if all right so one two three and four so it's because of this block here now 
Oh, what in the world? This sand just popped out. Uh, okay. Well, that normally doesn't happen, guys. I'm really sorry for that. Okay, so we press that button. One, two, three, four. So, once... Oh, my goodness. I'm sorry. My dog is going crazy. Yeah, he's in my room right now, but... It's just, uh... Let's try and figure out what's going on here. This is the wrong type of piston. Okay, so. We'll just add that piston back. I know it's this redstone. Oh, I broke a piston, or a repeater. Okay, so. We need to put that there, and I know that needs to go there. And... Oh, there we go. Wait, did I put it the wrong way? Oh, I probably put it the wrong way. No, I didn't. Wait, what? What? Th see, this shouldn't be powered here. I think it's because of those. Let me just break one and see. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Yeah, that's why, but we can't really help that. I guess it's supposed to be on. I don't know. Let's just do that, and then... Boom. So, now let's go ahead and try that. One. Put our button back. Two. Three. And four. Now, see, this sticky piston pushed out this block onto here. So, that is basically what will activate it. So, let's go ahead and press that. Then, one, there you go, uh, we need to continue our code, two, three, four. So, that, see, it sucked it back in. So, now what we gotta do, people, is, as you can see, uh, it pushes the block out to here, so we're gonna dig down one here. Well, hold on, we're, j let's do this first, and let's put the block down. Okay, so first let's go ahead and one, two, three, four. So that block is pushed out. So let's dig underneath of it like that. Let's just I made a mistake and uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and fill this in. So let's dig underneath of it and we'll need to put a redstone torch. So basically anything you want to be activated redstone wise, such as uh an iron door for example, a uh piston going up anything could be connected to this block now to power it so let's go ahead we're almost done here guys so one two three four so see it sucked it back in so it wouldn't give any power so let's go ahead and i think you have to press that button every time you want to do it just so everything doesn't mess up and it is quite a bit of redstone, guys. I'm sorry about that. But this is my first tutorial, and uh, I do like it. I think it's very useful, and I highly recommend it. So let's go ahead and uh, let's suck the uh, block back in so we can just show. One, two, three, four. Now, if you guys wanted to have the exact same code as I did, then just follow what I did exactly. But if you don't, like I said here... It's just all up to you, really. It's where you come into play, as FedEx Gaming said. So, you um, basically have to put the... Yeah, you do that. <laughs> but it's it's yours. Okay. So, let's go ahead and just, I don't know, here. Boom. Okay, so let's go ahead and just build kind of a small little room. I swear it won't take too long. Uh, just to kind of cover up the redstone, make it look pretty. Boom, 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 boom. And uh, what I used this for in one of my uh, servers with my friends, I used it for a kind of a vault thing like deal. Because um, that's where I can hide all my stuff and uh, my friends aren't allowed in it. 
So, uh, if you guys want to go see that, uh, then the series name is The World of Wraithen, and it's on the Fox of Justice's channel, who's one of my good buddies, and, uh, go subscribe to that channel as well. So, let's go ahead and put our redstone up here for the moment being. So, let's grab ourselves, uh, I don't know, a d iron door. So let's, yes, here it is. So I'm not really used to knowing where everything is here in uh, regular uh, survival. I mean, not survival, uh, console sur console Minecraft. So uh, I'm just going to, I had a pressure plate here. I'm not sure if that really does anything, but uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how you get out, actually. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and just hit reset just in case. So see our doors closed. Three and four, and guys, that is opened. And uh, boom, boom. Yeah, okay. So if you want to close it, what I have uh, set up on mine, I just have. Let's grab that, and then this. So uh, go ahead and get a button here or something, and it'll pull it back, and your door will be closed. Pull it back again, and uh, yeah. It's still closed. <laughs> well, see, uh, let's go ahead and light up the place because it is getting quite dark here. So it did take a lot, kind of a lot of materials, but uh, I highly recommend this build. And let's go ahead and see, just test it out one more time. See if we did anything wrong, any last minute fixes we need to do. But here we go, just reset it every time just to make sure. So one two three four now again one two three four is probably the most uh the easiest to guess password you can have i would recommend something that probably your friends wouldn't recommend uh you can oh, that not that your friends weren't recommend sorry that your friends wouldn't guess um there's also if you are like really good at redstone if you wanted to you can check out FedEx Gaming's channel and he has a tutorial for a nine button code which I'm assuming is just a bigger version of this but uh that is about it for this this is my redstone uh, key base thing and uh, you can have it too if you want um, but I highly recommend checking out the original video on FedEx Gaming's channel which uh, is just titled four button combination lock I, th I believe but uh, I don't know maybe if we get good reviews on this I uh, I will continue doing redstone tutorials um, but that is about it for this video guys uh, leave a like if you did enjoy this and you found it helpful and uh, please go check out FedEx Gaming's channel and give him some love. And uh, leave a comment saying uh, maybe <laughs> some better ways to do this if you wanted to or uh, stuff like that. Maybe uh, if FedEx Gaming is watching this, he can tell me hi. <laughs> I really am a fan of his. Um, now, uh, I will say, guys to check out that series I was talking about, which is The World of Wraithen. Wait, this is in my skin? What the heck? Oh, uh... Let's see, hold on, let me get into my normal skin here. I'm a, I'm normally, as you guys know, probably the rhinoceros. But, uh, as you guys... If you guys like this, uh, leave a like. If you didn't, um, I'm sorry. And, uh... Tell me why you didn't, please, in the comments. And subscribe to this channel and my main channel, Stop Licking My Chair. I know it's kind of a weird name, but I don't know why I did it. But it's pretty cool. So I will see you guys in the next video. I don't know why I talked like that.